Welcome back to the guys. Time for another anime first impression video. Welcome once again. This is going to be on a series airing on High Dive. Uh, there's as far as I know, two new series airing on High Dive. Uh, one is called Jellyfish Can't Swim in the Night. That's the one we'll be talking about today. Uh, there's another one airing, I uh, don't know the title yet, but it, I believe it already aired an episode. So this one, I think, has time of recording two episodes. It releases on Saturdays. And the first episode was actually really cute. I actually really enjoyed it. And um, I... You know, I didn't really know what to think about it. It was very colorful of a, of a series when it came to like just seeing it uh, by itself. So wasn't really sure what to expect out of it. I thought it was going to be moe, maybe a club series, uh, but wasn't really, really, really sure. So uh, I'm excited to see that. It's a little bit of everything. <laughs> I mean, uh, I I'm going to be honest. Yeah. So um, before anything else, though, if you have not done so by now, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Give some love by commenting, liking, and sharing. You guys can find me on social media and other places. I do apologize for my eye. Not really sure what's going on with it. So we'll put some drops on it. I'm hoping it's just allergies, but it is a little droopy today. So do apologize uh, for, for my eye. Um, but anyways, uh, go check out my other videos. I have quite a bit of first impressions already uh, that I've aired for this season. So if you're looking for specifically this season, there's quite a bit of them already out. So go check those out if you're interested. Um, okay, let's talk about Jellyfish Can't Swim in the Night. So um, it's it essentially takes place on... Um, Shibuya and Shibuya is a city that um, if if you know if you think about the US and think of artistic places you would probably think of maybe two places Hollywood or New York depending from what perspective you're coming from right Broadway or, or, or Hollywood itself um, Shibuya is basically uh, sort of like that for Japan um, most artists end up there but you also have a lot of like cool stuff that just uh, opens up there so it's 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 pretty much that I guess um, so we have um, quite a bit of people that or, or, or two girls that um, have shown up in in this city and they basically meet each other and they really needed each other more than they knew um, the one person that we follow mostly in this episode is Mahiru she is an illustrator and she doesn't really want to be considered an illustrator but she finds her passion in this episode and a formal idol uh, Kano shows up into the picture I want to say after maybe a few minutes into the episode and then it's basically how they become really good friends now as far as I see in the cover there's going to be two other girls that join the duel um, so it's going to be more of a group and I'm not sure if they're going to have their own thing or not but um, they they probably not like have their own I guess twist uh, to to what to who they are, who they were. So, Mahiru. Mahiru is struggling with the future. She doesn't know what she wants to do. She doesn't know um, what she wants to pursue. And that's essentially what she struggles in the beginning. And we kind of get this, this flashback that she at one time wanted to draw. She wanted to be an illustrator. Uh, she had won this contest which is what's a pretty much a big deal she was allowed to draw a mural in the shibuya uh, district and it was of jellyfish now when she finished it and was excited to showcase it to her friends uh her friends didn't know that what the, what they were being shown first of all so i guess we can't blame them too much and they were also little kids but they started making fun of it and saying like wow it's just so weird and the colors are just everywhere like who drew this like it's it's a mess and from there she basically 
grew embarrassment to her illustrations and really her passion of drawing. So um, this is where we find her essentially in in this episode um she's struggling there's other characters like there's there's a friend that encourages her but doesn't really push her much she has a little sibling who also comes out in the beginning of the anime and uh she seems to also push her to just kind of accept who she is and kind of like but she also like mocks her that she is a little childish with like her socks and stuff like that which kind of like it, it it they all show a type of friendship that is not enough right um and in, in, in this it's kind of weird because obviously the sister is enough but the sister's still making fun of her for what she wears and all that and and it's a very key point because the friend notices like the socks and stuff like that and tells her that she's cool for those socks. Um, well, she meets this girl in, in by her mural. Uh, she defends her mural because some street singer has posters all, all, all over it and taking advantage of the mural to promote her music. Well, she follows this girl to kind of thank her and she eventually catches up to her and she thanks her and they become friends instantly. Instantly, eventually Kano shows shows her that she is a um, like a secret youtuber um, artist that releases music online um, with without people knowing who she is like she doesn't show, she doesn't show her face um, but she's inspired by the mural that Makido had drawn so it connect it connects them from the beginning um, she then asked Makido to be her artist and she denies it so then there's like this whole struggle and eventually she does says yes eventually at the end of the episode but uh, it takes a while for them and um, we have this whole scene where they meet up again and um, kind of plays and um, showcases her music in public. And, you know, it's it's a very, like, um, heartwarming moment for, for both of them. Um, but, but, yeah, that in a nutshell is the first episode. I didn't do it justice, to be honest, to the first episode. But they, they it's, it, is, it is a good first episode. Um, I... I, if it wasn't on a Saturday, I just, I wish it was on a different day where I can actually react to it. I would definitely react to this one. Um, as a parent of four kids, Saturdays are busy. Even when they're not, they are. So, um, you know, I try not to react to a lot of Saturday animes just because um, I do end up being busy on those days. But I really want to react to this one. I don't know if um, if I will end up doing it or if it's just be one of those that I just enjoy watching on my own. And uh, hopefully through my review, people will hopefully go watch it. But I'm also hoping that this video encourages some of you guys to go watch it because it is a really good series. Um, I'm surprised High Dive have has this one to be honest because High Dive sometimes it's a it, it's it's a hit or miss but most of the time they're they're miss I mean they're not always but they have a lot of like more raunchy stuff and I thought this one was gonna be like that and there was kind of a scene in the beginning that was like indicating to that but then it wasn't so um, yeah props to them for this one um, thank you guys so much for watching this if you haven't done so by now subscribe to my channel and like i said i have more first impression videos so if you're interested in seeing more go check out my channel i do appreciate the love and support if you haven't done so by now subscribe and like always don't be strangers see you guys